workers loading up a truck destined for the beach. The dog beach in Wildwood, to be exact. On a hot day, a refreshing treat. This is Aladdin's Beach Brew. So Aladdin's Beach Brew is a family-run business. We started it this year after our dog Aladdin passed away. He's sitting on Trey's lap. Yes. We first met Aladdin, Laddie for short, five years ago, serving kids as a therapy dog at the Ronald McDonald House. Aladdin's a super dog, here to save pets. Aladdin was a super dog with a story so inspiring, he became the subject of a children's book, Aladdin the Superhero. He came from a very rough background. Someone had abused him, starved him, broken his legs. And I think that him coming from that makes him the dog that he is, and he just gives love to everybody. His was a life well lived. Laddie loved two things, meeting kids and being in the water. He died earlier this year, but the legacy he left behind brings those who knew him, like Chuck Perrant, to tears. Aladdin was amazing. I, I'm sorry about that, but uh, he's still giving when he's not here. Aladdin's beach brew keeps Laddie's memory alive. Proceeds from the sale of this specialized iced coffee helped sponsor Wildwood's National Night Out earlier this month. <laughs> and also paid for the adoption fees for dogs such as Lil Bug from the Lindenwald Animal Adoption Center. Michelle is amazing. Her and Aladdin have done so much good for the community, for the other shelters, and has brought so much positivity to children and other other animals and, and she's just an amazing dog. Lil Bug had a blast on her very first beach trip, a trip made possible by Aladdin's Beach Brew, which keeps alive the memory of a dog unlike any other. A lot of people have made it a point to come to the beach this year and support our business and his memory, which is great. Aladdin just attracted people to him and again, he's, he's still giving when he's not here in person. He's an amazing dog, and he'll be remembered for a long time for what he's done. Ted Greenberg, NBC 10 News.